Hey guys, I'll be showing you how to install browser hacks on your 3DS. So this is a big deal right now because it is the only way to access Homebrew on an 11.0 3DS without paying for something. So what I'm saying is that this is completely free and doesn't require another game. On top of that, it's extremely easy to use. So the first thing you need to do is you need to download and extract the Homebrew starter kit to the root of your 3DS's SD card. So we're just going to right click on it like this and extract all. And then you're going to go inside of it, go inside of the starter folder, and copy both of these files that you see to the root of your 3DS's SD card. So if you see anything that says to merge folders, overwrite stuff, you can just click yes, and we'll just wait for this to get done. So once that's done, you can eject your 3DS's SD card and put it back into your 3DS. So once all of that's done, then you can go on to your 3DS and load up the internet browser. So once this is loaded, we're going to go down here, and we're going to go to the Options button. And we're going to scroll down, and we're going to do Initialize Save Data. So this will clear all of the internet browser save data. And once this is done, it'll reboot to the Home menu, and then you can just load up the internet browser again. So now you can just enter all of the setup information and stuff. And now we're going to go to the URL box. And we're going to go to this URL. So this will load the auto browser hacks page. It'll automatically detect the best exploit to run on your system. So I'll just switch it so you can see like both screens a little bit. It's not going to be the best view, but yeah. And it should load, it should load the home relaunch, just like that. So now you can scroll down and check out the apps and make sure they work and stuff. And you can also change the folder and stuff by hitting the B button. So, let's just check to see if this one works. And it looks like it's working. So yeah, thank you guys for watching. Like, subscribe, comment for videos, tutorials, and stuff like this. And I'll see you next time.